in this video we are going to discuss about ppoe so ppoe in the full form you can see it stands for point to point protocol over the ethernet that means here the network protocol for encapsulating point to point so it inside the ethernet frames so here point to point protocol the internet frames is called ppoe here so it is used mainly with dsl services so the dsl services will be uh, the best example of using this protocol so when individual user connected to dsl modem over ethernet so over the ethernet an individual person connected to the dsl modem so that this works there so ethernet networks are packet based and have no capacity for connection or circuit so here clearly that this ethernet networks are packet based so that they are having no capacity for connecting or of a circuit here so coming coming to the basic security level features and speaking about them so they protect against ip and mac conflicts and rogue dhcp servers so this protects from the rogue dhcp servers and also from the mac address conflicts here with ppoe uses virtually dial to another machine so that point to point links will be established here so we'll see in this diagram clearly that if you see host a b and c are connected to the router a where the ppoe client is available and from there it is connected to the modem which is called a client device and from there it is connected to the ds dsl am which is a service provided device and here from there you can see the router which is having ppoe server and from there to the internet so this is how our broadband works you see this these are the customers which are connected to this router nearby and from this router which is having a ppoe client will connect to the modem of the client modem which is available in that area and from there it is connected to the dsl am so that it will be balancing the bandwidth from there this ppoe server which is there in the router b will connect to the internet so from there to here we get the internet using this broadband service so you see ppoe is primarily used in the telephone companies because you know many telephone companies provide you the uh, broadband services by using this service here so the protocol allows for easy separation of digital links and also this digital subscriber lines access for the multiplexers that means which is dsl am which is called a multiplexer so that you see here easy separation of digital subscriber line takes place here so it is required by the regulators also to have this dslm there clearly so ppoe also follows the isps to create a prepaid traffic that means whenever you see here about the prepaid traffic whenever you don't pay the amount for the next month the internet will be shut down based on the regulators here so here ppoe allows for the isps to create prepaid traffic business and also you see usually through dsl subscriptions so here dsl am plays the key role of a regulator and also you can see the allowing them to offer different speed tires based on the quality of service and also bandwidth controls through a single dsl so regulatory so that here the dsl modem acts as a regulatory here so basically ppoe offers an internet service provider which is called isp so that you can see here an easier way of tracking exactly how much bandwidth is used and based on it also you can see our fair usage plans also are categorized based on this dsl am regulator so however you can see uh, that the use of vpn with ppoe you are able to view or you can able to prevent an isp from monitoring your dsl connection but here the isp commonly use deep packet inspection to analyze so that this deep packet inspection will analyze the internet traffic and limit your bandwidth so based on this service itself the fup fair usage plan is categorized so that based on your bandwidth so you see the internet traffic and the bandwidth are proportional to each other so based on the internet traffic is high sometimes you get more speed and sometimes you get less speed because of the traffic here so this is about the pppoe that is point to point protocol over the ethernet